Welcome back to Dungeons and Ale, a channel where we just come up with crazy D&D &D campaigns and play through them. Right now we're doing a Spider-Verse campaign where they are multiple individuals from the multiverse of Spider-Men who are currently chasing down Carnage. Yeah, Carnage got like loose, he got put out into the multiverse and they're trying to figure out what he's doing. All of his gooey tendrils floating around. The last episode, they uh, arrived in an old west town, met with Web Slinger, and discovered a giant injector which they could use to eradicate any form of symbiote. How many do we have left? Four. Five. Four? All right. I think yeah. it was 16. <laughs> 37? 37 injectors. <laughs> I, I don't know how we're carrying him. I found the duplication glitch. <laughs> He's doing injectors. <laughs> this game's like easy mode, guys. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> hey, Carnage. Hey, this. Here's 37 of them. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, they then proceeded to go to the mines where they discovered Web Slinger had been taken over by a Carnage symbiote because Huey left him behind and he was an idiot. I wasn't an idiot. No, Web Slinger's oh, an idiot. Oh, I was just saying, I told him he could come, but no, I told him to wait. Yeah, you did. You left him behind. Yeah. I was hoping he'd get taken over so we could end him. <laughs> so just we so we didn't have to hear his accent. <laughs> and he says, yeah. Partner? No. Uh, no, you can't talk like that anymore. Now he's carnage. You used an injector on Web Slinger, and you used an injector on the doorway, and you got yourselves in. Yeah. Hero point. <laughs> That's true. It was like a team effort hero point. Yeah. Too. yeah. All right. Now you are at the entrance to the mines covered in carnage goo. Wait, we are, are in goo. Or or the mines what, are what did I write here? Goo. Oh, here it is. Never mind. Uh, that, that was at the fight. <laughs> I was like, that note doesn't add up. When we last left off, <laughs> you were looking for I was going to say, I don't want to be covered in carnage goo. I don't have any extra suits. <laughs> my world was destroyed. Where's my we know costume? you don't stop <laughs> talking about it. Seriously, it was very sad. All right, so you chased Carnage's, te Carnage's tendrils to the old mine where you defeated the webslinger instantly and took out the doorway, leading to a series of mines where Carnage is hiding. But why is he here? What is he, what is he here for? What is he drawn to and what is going on? These are all questions you have yet to answer because I haven't given you a way to find them out yet. <laughs> and why do we care? I didn't know we were asking them. Yes. <laughs> and also an excellent question. <laughs> You walk into the first room of the mine. It is pitch black. You can't see anything. And you hear echoing from deep within. Three little spiders crawling through my minds. What will you ever do? Do you think you can save the world that I've already consumed? Yep. Shouldn't you be concerned with your worlds? Nope. What state did you leave them in? Bad. How are all of you little spider? How New are York. all those little spiders or people? Because we never clarified on your world, Web Warrior. <laughs> it's weird that he immediately started monologue. <laughs> Usually they wait till we it's get weird in. That I, I got a, a chance to participate in his monologue. <laughs> I never get involved. <laughs> what about your world, conquered by Shumagorath that you left behind, Spider Strange? I, I sent Shumagorath somewhere. <laughs> it's fine. That's true. You put a <laughs> ring on him. The world. <laughs> Well, should be okay. Yes, yeah, should be fine. It's probably <laughs> fine. Ah, you got nothing what, on me. What My world was actually already destroyed with you, McCoy. <laughs> <laughs> I've got nothing. <laughs> How, how about, made how about you three just return to your worlds and leave this one to me before the rain comes down and washes you all out? Did you really just do what <laughs> I? He, yeah. Why is he doing a nursery rhyme? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Carnage was much cooler on my world. I'm just saying. <laughs> Carnage Joker? No, that's the Laughing Goblin. Oh, right, right. God, get my world right. <laughs> I've literally said that several times. <laughs> you said to get your world right? No, the Laughing Goblin. So well, what was Carnage? I haven't decided yet, but I can almost guarantee it was cooler than this one. <laughs> Carnage Bane. Baneage. <laughs> no, that's stupid, too. Yeah. Sounds a little too close to bondage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that is Carnage. This is what I used thing. to do with Black Catwoman. No, that sounded weird. <laughs> Can't use that name. I don't think you can. Yeah, I don't think we're going to use that kind of name. No, no, no. Catwoman Noir. That's better. Yeah, yeah Noir yeah. Cat. Yeah. Something along those lines. Yeah, mine didn't work. No, it did not. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, All right, so the room in front of you is 
pitch black. You guys can't vision. see anything. I can actually see in the dark. Okay, so it's slightly got like a haze to it. It's all black and white and gray and whatever night vision. I just looks. have night vision in my goggles. Or my cowl. <laughs> so Dan, you can't see anything. Oh God, <laughs> I can see like it's daylight. How are you guys? Doing? I can see like hues of gray. Okay, cool. <laughs> Stop walking the wall. I thought it was pitch black. <laughs> I thought my eyes were closed for a second there. <laughs> also, on my utility belt, I have a flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> Does it, like, in the center, it's got a little bat symbol? <laughs> no, it's a Spider-Man symbol. Oh, okay. Obviously, but with Why? wings. So, like a bat spider symbol. Yes, like okay. a spider bat. The room contains a lot of mining equipment, rusted pickaxes and such. The tendrils from the door are Ooh, leading nice. deeper into the mine, but they look inactive and dead from whatever was in that serum. The air is thick in this spot. Seemingly no airflow going through. I cut Feels out a heavy donut. in your what? I cut out a little donut and eat it, you know, Scooby Doo style. <laughs> it feels heavy on your lungs, like you're already out of breath stepping into this place. <sighs> Wait, I don't need to breathe. I'm a spider. I don't have lungs. <laughs> so Actually, you're, you're out of breath, Andy. <laughs> this ain't good. <laughs> This is how it always sounds. <laughs> this is just your Batman voice anyway. <laughs> like Christian Bale. Sorry, keep going. Oh. All right. And then straight around all of the equipment is the tunnel moving down, which is also pitch black. So he still can't see other than the one flashlight. Hey, guys, what's going on around there? Oh, thank you. Uh, very different forms of gray. Ah, perfect. He turns the flash in into your eyes, Andy, immediately blinding you. <laughs> my eyes! <laughs> Oh my doing? god, this is just like last time I flashed Batman. No, I'm blind <laughs> as a bat. <laughs> Follow my voice. Echo location. <laughs> ah, ah. <laughs> All right, so what do you guys want to do? Looking down oh, the hallway, you see one jar. tunnel to the right and one tunnel to the left. It's like I drew them on the map. So <laughs> I want to go I bet I know to that one. It. I want to go to that book looking thing. Now we'll go there last. Okay. I'm in charge. You I'm in charge. Oh he just said it was. I, so. yeah, I just don't want to be in charge. I forgot I have half my health because of the necrotic damage. We really need to take a nap. We really do. This whole floor seems to be dead. There's more tendrils going down the hallway, but they're all pretty much dead from the serum that was I'm used. I'm sleeping. All right, I got a plan. I got a I'm plan. I'm sleeping for a solid eight. Let's, yeah, let's, let's make some walls of webs. Just take a quick eight, eight hour nap. I'm used to this without a 14 hour nap. <laughs> One at a time. Hey, yeah, but single file. I'm gonna be in the back, <laughs> hiding in the shadows. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa! I'm hiding in the shadows. I'm hiding behind you. Why? I'm I hiding in your AC. shadow. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna. Why don't you guys just like wait while I stealth forward? Because in my super sweet shadowy. Abilities. That's not how. We do? I lead. Okay, so I you lead, lead face first into danger. <laughs> All right, so uh, we're Andy, Go ahead, we'll wait. <laughs> go ahead and do your stuff. As you walk in, the room appears to be wide open. It's, it looks to be a locker room for the miners that would go through this mine. Oh, yeah. The number, the lockers are all numbered one through Mine 10, and I wrote them on there, but I realize now they're upside down to you. <laughs> no, I can see them. One, I mean, two, yeah, three, I mean, four, I'm not five, an idiot. Six, <laughs> you don't know how to read numbers seven. upside down. <laughs> My gosh. Another what kind six. Of, what kind of freaky nine, puzzle ten. is this? You no, did write two sixes. Your eight's a six. <laughs> is it? Yeah. Oh, it's just a way of right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, but I'm it. the one who couldn't figure it out. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> uh, the room is, is still pitch black like everything else. There are dead tendrils across the ground. Everywhere you step is like a squishy sound. <laughs> <laughs> Go do your stealthy stuff. Go be Shadow Man. That's it's another superhero. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm stealthing into the room. Okay. In the shadows. You see lockers. <laughs> Numbered one through ten. <laughs> Numbered one through ten. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's lockers in here. <laughs> wait, Anything wait, special sorry. about them? There's lockers in here. <laughs> but he's like two people behind you. Anything special about them? <laughs> They're number one through ten. Oh, okay. there's actually two sixes. No, oh, that makes sense. Yeah. I'm mocking you now <laughs> because I want to. You're just listening to this. Yeah, nice. I'm like, I'm over here just going, this is great. I'm usually the target of the <laughs> harassment. So Kevin, go in there and open one of the lives. <laughs> I forgot my name was Kevin. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I you, I mean, you've got the most life out of all of us. I mean, not anymore. <laughs> it's actually not true at all. <laughs> I do have the most armor, though. That is true. You know what? I'll go in. 
Wait, what's your armor? I died. <laughs> I died. <laughs> 19. Oh, yeah. You got the most armor. Go oh, in there and get take, take a couple of I've just, I've just been I looking at your to... paladin and yeah. warlock anymore. <laughs> but I'm trying to figure out how to remove necrotic damage because I We take a nap. Yeah. Is that literally the yeah, only one? Or you have nap. like. Uh, greater restoration. Greater restoration. Greater restoration. No, heal, doesn't healing do it? No. I know potions. See, that's why I was looking it up, is I wasn't sure. What you could do? You gotta sleep I kinda, it off. I kind of need to get <laughs> you 50 have dead tissue back. that you need to sleep off. That's how it works. I mean, I could <laughs> shed my webbing. Just put me in your pocket. <laughs> put me in what? Just until I recharge. It's a little Kevin. My webbing <laughs> land. I give him a little. All right, I'll, I'll check this one. I'll, I walk inside. Let's see. I look around. You look around and you see lockers, dust and grime are kind of all over the place. You see like some just dirt. You see the numbered lockers Damn. in general. Uh, you get a weird odor this. from a couple of them. Oh, and you weird. immediately take a pickaxe to the head. Do I, do I smell this one on my right? <laughs> do you smell it? Yeah, you don't. tell you me. Do. Uh, do you smell it? You don't smell do anything smell in seven. Ah. I go I go one of the stinky ones. <laughs> clink, clink, clink. <laughs> I, I knock on it. Nothing happens. It knocks back. Is it, it knocks back. <laughs> is it hollow or solid sounding? Oh, like it is, sounds hollow. Is like, it like it's a, a locker. Okay. Well, <laughs> it could be bound with carnage symbiote on the other side, which would make it not sound hollow. <laughs> it's still a metal empty locker. I go to one of the stinky ones. Go to ah, the stinky one. He said okay. it was empty. Okay, we're good. <laughs> uh, you walk to over <laughs> to uh, locker number eight, Andy. Uh, that's six two. Yeah, which one is yeah six B? I go over to Locker 6B. <laughs> oh, my God. No, just Houston. <laughs> that one's red. It's evil. <laughs> <laughs> it's obviously a carnage. Yeah. <laughs> Is there, like, little grates in yep. it? Yep. Oh, look inside the grates. You don't see anything. It looks dark in there. And then with your night vision, you just still can't really see much except for, like, a slung bag inside of there that's just kind of hanging on a hook. I found Carnage's testicle. <laughs> <laughs> I opened the locker. In oh slowly. <laughs> inside you find a bag. Of Carnage testicles. <laughs> of Carnage testicles. <laughs> I use my webbing and pull it down. Okay. Twip. Nothing happens. I smell it. It smells rank. It smells rank. <laughs> but it's underwear. Spoiled. Kevin, come over here and open this bag. <laughs> You have more armor than us. <laughs> you didn't open yours up, did you, Dan? I I've, I've still haven't opened mine up. Okay, yet. okay. No, no, no. I'll I should open probably the bag check for it. you. If I die, I'll just come back as the spirit of. That's true, yeah. yeah. Something. I don't know what Of regret. Yet. The spirit of regret. Oh, and I don't regret. think we should do that. Last time, I really regretted it. <laughs> Everything is regret yeah. now. All right, you know what? I'll open mine. You open up yours? Yeah. Are, the, is, are you actually opening your bag first? Yeah. Okay. Oh. As you open up the bag. Inside, you find what appears to be a miner's lunch rotting away. Aw, man, that was a good sandwich. <laughs> what kind of sandwich is it? You can't tell at this point. The entire thing is just mold. I could tell. <laughs> Give me a perception roll. <laughs> that's impressive. Um, yeah, that's a solid nine. I could tell. <laughs> <laughs> it's green, whatever it was. Ah, olive loaf. <laughs> That's a strange ability you have, so <laughs> <laughs> I really studied lunch meats. <laughs> you right, Dan, as you lunch. open up yours slowly, inside you find a canteen hung there. Smell it. Hmm. I shake it. You hear sloshing of wa liquids around. Ooh, Ooh it's water. He said right. it. <laughs> I open it up and I smell it. Well, Smells like it's not water. <laughs> You pull back immediately at the just oh. smell from it. It was so strong. Is it strong like alcohol? It's strong like alcohol. It's right. Hey guys, <laughs> hey guys, celebration drink afterwards. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm, you finishing that would kill you. <laughs> well, we'll find not, out. Not even the spider, <laughs> just Dan. <laughs> but you know what? If Carnage doesn't kill me, I will. I open 10. Wait, 10? <laughs> As you, as you get near 10, you hear banging. And as you open it up, inside you see a bag that is swinging back and forth, hitting the wall. Oh, it's a cat. <laughs> what? It's a cat in the bag. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> a constant miner's tool. Well, we got to be careful. A cat in a bag. <laughs> we got to be careful. We don't want to let the cat out of the bag. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Spider-Man point? Is it making sounds? I'll give, you, I'll give you a yes. spider point for that. <laughs> Is the bag making sounds? Yeah, squeaking. What kind of squeaking? Not meowing. <laughs> Probably kittens. We should drown them. <laughs> what? what? Dang. Right. What? <laughs> this took a turn. What? I don't like um, cats. <laughs> I don't like cats. Good to know. I thought, I thought that's what your lady was. <laughs> your Catwoman Noir. <laughs> Guys, this one's moving. Poke it with a stick. Yeah, I actually agree with this one. You're in charge. Do something. I poke it with a stick. Where did you get a stick? I found the old pickaxe. It's true. He actually Ooh, did. Okay, yeah. I'll give you that. A pickaxe is a poke form it, of a it stick. It squeals even louder, and you hear like it. flapping inside of the bat. <gasps> it's bats. It's a spider bat. You should open it. It's your people. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> My children of the night. Did you really just... Sure, why not? <laughs> As, As you, you open it. everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> no one saw that. They were not going to cut to that. Uh, <laughs> you keep this in, Dylan. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to cut away. It's cut away at that moment. As you open up the bag... Your face gets attached by what appears to be one of the carnage like bat creatures from before. I was so wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh Give me a strength roll. It's coming for a grapple immediately. <laughs> I was so wrong. It's trying to put his wing wing in my mouth. <laughs> 20? 20. You make it. Yeah. It hits you, tries to grab you. You quickly rip it off. It's a bad bat. It. And burning hands. Oh. Ooh. Give needs me to a, make a deck save. Yeah, give me a deck save. No, it you needs need to, to make, make a deck save. save. Well, you're, yeah, but you have to, if you can grab a flank. I don't need to grab it. I just have to touch it. Okay. <laughs> Ben's like, doesn't matter. Roll. <laughs> you don't have that back when you get a moment. You know how Ben's DMing style <laughs> works. It's right next. To uh, 17. It makes it so it takes half damage, so it's just going to take full damage because it's fire. Right. Nice. Uh, it takes a solid, not a lot, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine? Yep. It bursts into flames right in front of Andy's face. Not that cool. <laughs> Your night vision is kind of like malfunctioning slightly now. Bleep. Is it dead? Yes. Okay. I took care of it. You're welcome. We should probably not be in this room anymore. I don't feel like there's anything. Probably there. not. <laughs> we should go to that room. Okay. I'm the leader. I see we go there. All right. As you approach that room, you see a barred gate in front of it. There's a barred gate with a chain, like a like a chain link chain. <laughs> okay, like a chain link chain. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And uh, what appears to be a master padlock on it, which is bigger than a normal novice padlock. <laughs> I fire bolt the padlock. Just I was going to sacred flame it. We got the same <laughs> wavelength here. Just going to shoot it? Yeah. Uh, roll for attack. That's fair. Let's see if I actually hit it. Um, 13. 13. It hits the padlock, and you just see it kind of melt away as it's just an old rusted iron padlock from the Old West. And that you're using melt. They're made of liquid. Yep. <laughs> no, we heated it up, so just melt it down. <laughs> Sure. Have you not seen movies? <laughs> anyway, chain's gone. <laughs> Fixed it. Solve that problem. As you go to put your hands in the bar and push it open, behind the doorway in the pitch black that only you can see at this point, Andy, you, yours is flickering on and off, so you can kind of see, kind of not see. <laughs> Something's wrong with my cow. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you hitting yourself? I don't know. Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. <laughs> Um, you hear like sloshing and slithering around inside of that room. What do you? What do you hear? Apparently, I can't hear with my vision. Sloshing and slithering around in that room. We shouldn't go there. It almost, uh, it almost, you feel like it's pulsating. Probably, uh, it's pulsating. Oh god! I go look at the butt door. As you approach the butt door, <laughs> <laughs> it does look like. It does kind of look like a butt. <laughs> I didn't really notice it until you said it, but yeah, it kind of looks like a butt. Uh, all right, so as you approach the butt door, it has the apparently the face of carnage, but the face is like dead. It has no life in it like the front of the mine. The tendrils connected to it have already been affected by the serum. 
What appears to be holding it in place is a star-shaped object where its mouth should be. It's butthole. Yeah. And around the butthole mouth... <laughs> I knew Carnage was a butt face. I knew Around it. it, you see a series of symbols. Give me an Arcana check. Ooh. I know nothing about these symbols. <laughs> Here, let me let me try with my hey minus hey one. religious boy can you check this out for me ah with my minus one I got a fifteen you did better than me <laughs> you recognize it as something that is a, that is on every world well guys this is on every world it's I saw it on the first one and then the next one and then mine but I never registered that it might be important no no it's like it's on every world now. in general you haven't seen it on this adventure yet no I have <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember seeing it on my world and we can't check. Because my world is gone. <laughs> Destroyed by shoot. You recognize it as symbols of the dark hold. It's the symbols of the dark hold. What's that? It's. You don't know the dark? You don't know no, the... I do, but uh, I want to hear what your version is so that I can actually say what it is. But I'm pretty sure it's some sort of <laughs> magical book of the damned. I'm going to call Wanda. Hold on. She's not answering. Do you have your inner dimensional phone? Yeah, wait, what are you using to call her? <laughs> I have an inner dimensional phone. Every spider person does. <laughs> this is true. Hold on, I got this. It's actually true. Spider teenager, we need you to patch us through to Wanda. <laughs> on your world? <laughs> sure. <laughs> on you gotta find Maximoff this. Wanda. <laughs> Maximoff Maximoff Wanda. Maximoff Wanda. Or on like his her. world? Is From... she good or evil in her world? That's wait. a great question. We'll find out. <laughs> just, just tune in next time. <laughs> have her contact the spider witch. Right? Mm -hmm. Who's the spider witch? It's There's an amalgamation Wanda Parker. of Wanda. Yeah, 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 it's Wanda Parker. Okay, so who are we calling through the spider zero? All of them. <laughs> Whoever picks up first. Contact <laughs> anyone who knows anything about the Darkhold. Please. <laughs> Please. She's, well, she's good at my world. We have a thing. She doesn't know. <laughs> she doesn't know. <laughs> That's creepy. <laughs> All right, so Maximoff <laughs> Wanda comes through. Spider Strange, or what are you going by now? Yeah, it's still that. Okay. Spider Sorcerer, or uh, hold Spider on. Sorcerer Spider Sorcerer Supreme of Vengeance. <laughs> Ooh, I like that one. <laughs> he just keeps adding. He got a lot of names. <laughs> he yeah, just so keeps adding to his about. moniker. Esquire <laughs> the third. <laughs> How are you the third? <laughs> um, Maximoff Wanda. Yeah. Okay. That's Pulling wing in this. Was not expecting this. Yeah, you should have. <laughs> Yo, you're right. I should plan that you guys are just going to call people. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's like the phone dark hole. We're trying to help you work on your improv. Go. <laughs> okay, so I got to do an accent. <laughs> oh, God. oh, God. No, you don't. Know your strengths. <laughs> okay, so Spider Zero patches through to Maximoff Wanda? Yeah. Okay. Who is this? It's, it's Spider Supreme. Spider Supreme, vengeance of the Lord of the Damned. She doesn't know that part. <laughs> She's true. in the magic. They know who your new spirit of vengeance is. Oh, that's true. <laughs> hey, I got the spirit of vengeance. It's pretty sweet, but I need your help. Oh, we're doing small talk. Oh, yeah. so that was not the time, time to catch work? up. <laughs> Huh? So how's that even work? How do you have so Doctor Strange powers and Spider Vengeance powers and Spider Man? It's, we don't have time. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna patch through some of these symbols. Can you tell me what they mean? Tell you what the symbols mean. Yeah. They're from the dark hold. They're from the dark hold. Yeah. Okay. I'm doing a Huey right now. Just <laughs> yeah. I poke him and I go, tell her I said hi. <laughs> the web warrior says hi. Yeah. Who's the web warrior? You'll meet him eventually. Oh, okay, cool. But anyway, do what do these symbols mean? She looks at the symbols and she patches it back through. These symbols are the symbols that are basically as a, a ward to prevent anybody from passing through this area. But one symbol on there stands out from the rest. And it's a symbol of power. A power so deep and so powerful that even beings such as Shuma Gorath and oh, what's the name of the other one? The other one that does stupid things. <laughs> Dr. Doom. No. Dr. Octavius. No. Dormammu of Kundabari. That one. Dormammu. Dormammu of Kundabari. I love his name, Dormammu. <laughs> Baron Mordo. <laughs> Dormammu and Baron Mordo all use it to patch into the power from the multiverse. Charles Xavier. Ask her if it's magic. <laughs> Is it magic? It's the dark hole. You're an idiot. You're an idiot. That is, <laughs> is that a yes? No. At this point, I'm just like leaning against the wall. <laughs> I'm gonna. How do we break them? How do you? Well, if it's being used as a doorway, I'm assuming this is being used as a doorway. I imagine the rest that. of it looks like a butthole on a mouth. What, if, what <laughs> that, you're telling me? <laughs> Carnage does not know what he's doing. We need to find the butthole key to penetrate the butthole door. Oh, I mean, 
That's a little bit lewd, but yeah, no, it's basically it. <laughs> okay. I figured it out. Thanks, Maximoff. We'll talk later. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Hey, are you coming to the party this weekend? Wait, there's a party this weekend? Yeah, there's a big Sorcerer Supreme party. All of them from the different multiverse are showing up. Guys, I gotta go. <laughs> Good <Okay>. luck. <laughs> we'll be fine. Okay, bye. Click. <laughs> you just hung up on her. I said bye. I bet, I bet you the button. He did say here. bye. Yeah, probably. Yeah. I got a better idea. <laughs> What's your idea? Then finding the butthole key? Yes. Oh, okay. I cast a spell magic on the door. Has no effect on it as it already is apparently innate or, or inert. That's uh, the word. <laughs> the door itself is innately a door. Well, if it's it's a, if it's inert, it does it means it's not working. You just push through it. <laughs> yeah. I push on the door. It's kind of rubbery, and as you push against it, it bounces back. Oh, like it's weird. kind of attached to and the wall. Eight hundred eyeballs open up. Oh God! They're pulsating. Too. And then a hand jumps in your face. <laughs> we need the butthole key. I guess we'll get a butthole key. I guess we got to go into the sloshy room. <laughs> we got to go through the sloshy room to get the butthole key. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really. I was watching, I was really, watching really, porn last night. Just, I'm really concerned what the sloshing <laughs> is. <laughs> oh, wait, we're in. <laughs> We're in Carnage's bowels. <laughs> These aren't mines at all. <laughs> I figured out the, the dungeon. Solved it in one. <laughs> We're in his colon. All right, well. That oh, explains the all smell. All I did was put a star symbol there and it turned it into a butthole. Yeah. Yeah. For Quick, once, you didn't get say one butthole. of the horse seven <laughs> Yeah, I, hey, I was told to stop saying that. <laughs> <laughs> Who said to stop saying it? Dan. Oh. Why would you say that? <laughs> Stop saying what? Horses, Horses and seven yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't say don't. I just said that you're the one that said it first. <laughs> that is true, yeah. Anyway, we go back to the sloshing room. As you enter the room, this room appears kind of alive. The tendrils are get, get a little bit more life, but they're still being mildly yes. affected. So the room itself is covered in tendrils all across it. There's dripping goo from the ceiling that looks like symbiote goo. And you hear movement happening from the room in the back. Are the tendrils alive? Mm, they they look like they've got life in them, but they're not connected to a source because of the, the serum going through the main hallway. I mean, we got four left. Yeah, let's see what's moving first. Go, go scope it out with your <laughs> shadowy... Shadows. I slipped through the shadows. <laughs> I... Everything's a shadow right now, so you I literally just moving. slipped through the darkness. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> Why did Ben make a dungeon with no lights? <laughs> and it's like, I've done this before, so you think you would have figured it out. <laughs> He's Naruto running, just so you know. In inside of this room. <laughs> this is me, Naruto running on the okay, wall. Okay, okay. That's what I thought you were I doing. I am the darkness. I look to the Sorcerer Supreme. I can't see him, but it sounds like he's Naruto running. He definitely is. He slipped into the shadow, so I can't see him either. Perfect. There's five of them. We only have to fight one. Stab each one with the serum. Inside of the room, you see what appears to be four of the like more simple-minded thralls. On the back wall is one of the giant brutes. In the middle is what appears to be a pit going straight down about 20 feet. And they all seem to be on their knees praising the glowing object in the middle of the pit. The pit is what where the tendrils are coming down. You worry that maybe your stickiness, I don't know what we're going to call it, but your stickiness won't work. <laughs> My hmm. stickiness? Spider sticky? Oh, like to crawl. <laughs> yeah. I'm clarifying now. Stickiness. <laughs> oh, I'm all sticky now. <laughs> <laughs> But they, they are Man, completely unaware of you as you currently are the knight. <laughs> I am the knight. Stab the big one with a syringe. Is there stuff on the, the ceiling in here as well? Uh, no, the ceiling's pretty empty at the moment. Right, the the tendrils kind of go up the wall, but as they're not attached to anything giving them life, they're not really pulling up. I'm going to crawl along the ceiling. Okay. It's okay. Shh. I got this. I look down the hole. Looking down the hole, you see movement around it, but at the very center is what you have dubbed the butthole key. Ah, yes. <laughs> the MacGuffin. What do you see in there? I found the butthole key. Well, grab it. What does it look go. like? I swip swip and grab the butthole key. <laughs> Give me a, uh, you know, I'll just let you hit it. As you grab the key, you see the sides of the walls kind of reach out and grab your webbing. And they begin to kind of pull back against you. It didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> do you have a syringe on you? I do. 
Mission Impossible down <laughs> and stab the walls with the... The st- stuff grabbing your webs, it seemed to be sprouting wings like you feel like those carnage bats are kind of... Oh, oh yeah. Ben finished watching season two. Of- <laughs> <laughs> um, I am going to uh, thwip down and swing and leap at this guy and go bat flip. And I'm going to stab him with the syringe. The, bl- the, the big guy, yeah. Okay. As you stab the big guy with the, with the thing, he just kind of go. He becomes aware of you, obviously. And he looks up and his face, Surprise. like his jaw kind of pops <laughs> off first and his eye falls out and he just kind of like goops down. Uh, I'm going to need help in here in a minute. I'm coming. I did a thing. I did a thing. <laughs> I'm going to use him as like a shield against the other one. So you got like a, cor- a melting corpse. Yeah, yeah. Ah, let's go. And I start to the other four on their ranks. knees look up and you see their eyes kind of like glow red and the carnage swirl on their forehead. And they step. Let's go, Tinkerbells. <laughs> uh, and we will roll initiative. <laughs> That's awful. <laughs> yeah, same. Mine is not. Not awful or not? <laughs> not awful. <laughs> Mine is not an initiative. I'm gonna roll again. <laughs> Mine is not a thing I am doing today. It's okay. I took out the big one. I have dropped my Batman accent now. This is actually how I really speak. <laughs> uh, I am Parker Wade. <laughs> Parker Wade. Uh, 12. 12. Andy? 25. <laughs> Nine. It's like a 25, except not at all. The best part is that we all have alerts. So we've got a plus five. Yeah, I rolled a two. <laughs> rolled a two. <laughs> I guess darkness. <laughs> darkness. All right, Andy, you're up first. Of course I am. Uh, I'm going to give you, right now, while you're holding the body in front of you, uh, it will completely dissolve within the next three to five turns, depending how often you use it. But you get a plus two to your AC while using that as a body shield. Cool. While uh, using the person? Yeah, he's holding a body that's disintegrating, so it's like oh, a okay. struggle. But there's literally a mass between him and them at the moment. I blow a spider ring and throw it at this guy. <laughs> right. I blow two spider rings. <laughs> that guy. So that was a multi attack? I have multi attack. I thought you were going to do something else. And I whip. Oh. One, one is an at 20. Nice. <laughs> the other is a mere 13. They hit. Yeah. <laughs> the net 20 misses. We'll never oh. stop making that joke. No, I won't. <laughs> we still do that in our home game. No, I know. That's what, that's what I said. We will never stop making that joke. Sure think. won't. All right. So that's just going to be the normal one. <laughs> that's I'm a six. On this Come on. It's, if it's a one, I'm going to be pissed. That's better. Uh, that's it's better. better. It's better. Uh, so he takes a total of 18 damage. 18 damage on him? From spider orang smacking into him. Twip, twip. 18? Okay. And then... Get I batted. I'm gonna do... Nothing else. <laughs> that is all. All right, so that one right there moves towards you. What you got, Twinkle Toes? Which one? The one you just hit. Okay, that's number one. Me. What you got, Tinker Toes? Uh, and as he comes at you, he's going to use Slam. Hot. Which he gets to use one time because he's mindless. Nat 20. Sure. So does that hit? <laughs> no. No, misses? No, misses. Nat 20 armor. Yeah. And, oh, yay me. Six damage. <laughs> oh, God. It feels like that was as good as he could get <laughs> like you put a lot of effort into that and it didn't really do much I feel bad for you um, are you two are visible right you're not hiding yeah we okay, so two, two, uh, wait two. so I'm gonna need help in here the next one right up the top there Andy this one no I went up this one that one goes towards you Huey yeah it goes to Dan <laughs> screw him I'm on the as ceiling. is tradition uh, 10 <laughs> he misses Balls. misses okay uh, Dan you're up alright I uh I'm going to go, ha, 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 and I cast Magic Weapon on my sword, and I charge this guy and I swing at him. Twice. He's got a web sword. It's cool. Yeah. Jealous. Right? I've got uh, 13. Like eight Oof. Yeah, 13 and 10. To hit? Yeah. Both hit. Really? Yeah. All right. I'll take that. You just, like, right, carded so down. Yeah, they're just... <laughs> oh. I can put lots of them in a spot. We can Dynasty Warriors and shit. <laughs> 16 <laughs> damage. Huh? 16. All right. Uh, you hit that what one. Is Andy. Andy. All right. So three and four are going to go towards Dan. What's this? It's if you're two-handing it. 
If you're two-handed, you use a d10. Oh, okay. uh, 16 and a 19. Uh, the 19 hits. Three damage. Ugh. Move those last two towards Dan, please. Oh, my God. Uh, at least Huey, it's not up. necrotic. Um, <laughs> it's necrotic. Because he's ah, on me. I will fire... Um, Dan's guy? Fireball, the one behind me. No, Dan. fireball. The one. <laughs> I don't have fireball Hell, yet. Yeah. <laughs> I got no, a couple of bad grenades. <laughs> I'm a fireball right here. It's going to hit everybody in the room. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no. Yeah, I'd go for it. Well, I, got a, I got a bat 40 millimeter grenade launcher. Uh, 10? A lot of stuff in this huh? belt. 10? 10 hits. All right. So, that so is... the fireball damage is now a radius of 20 feet. <laughs> bat M60. I'm going to need everybody to fail their holding. deck saves. Bat Thanks. Flamethrower. It should be a belt. Where are my D10s? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's one. Uh, his deck save is a 7. That was a lie. I didn't actually oh. need deck saves. <laughs> uh, he's going to take... Eight fire damage. Eight. So you do, you're doubling that for a normal fire, so right? So 16. 16. He explodes into a symbiote goo that is on fire, which splatters in the back of Web Warrior's head. Sorry about that. Ah. <laughs> Crispy carnage bits, though. I know you like those. <laughs> yeah, but when they're properly cooked. And then I'm going to try it and... <laughs> for a medium well. I'm going to try and thwip to the ceiling. Try. Can okay, you do it? <laughs> Well, no. It, well, there's a guy on There's me. a guy. We're getting oh, about okay. That's, that I didn't realize. I forgot he was in the other Just one, not that one. Worst DM. Uh, seven. He misses. I threw it to the ceiling. All right. Uh, Andy, you're up. <laughs> it's a good thing the ceiling's done. Get a hold of there, right, Andy? Repellent. There you go. Oh, no. Oh, there is head. I don't know why oh, God. <laughs> uh, I am going to really coolly let the body <laughs> drop into the pit. Okay. Just like release it. <laughs> and then I'm going to step forward and I'm just going to pop pop. Uh, as it falls into the pit, you see the carnage bat creatures that are now formed up kind of just lunge at it and begin to munch. Nom, right. nom, 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 nom. Reabsorbing the symbiote goo. That is not good. Uh, that is like... That is a nat one. <laughs> That's definitely going to miss. Uh, the other one not is... Not as cool, huh? Not as cool. Uh, the other one is a, an 11, though. So that that is. Uh, and then I'm just going to go ahead and flurry of bats. I'm sorry, flurry of spider bats. <laughs> and... Keep forgetting to add spider to it because I'm more spider than bat. Although I seem to be more <laughs> bat than spider. Are you more fly time. than human? <laughs> and I'm gonna do it again, or hit him again. Okay, that's definitely gonna hit. So he hits twice, and I of course say biff bam, bow, bow. Uh, so that's going to be that's not terrible. Twenty-one damage. Twenty-one. He, as you begin to punch him, he just starts to like goop on your fist as uh, he's like just falling apart. That's gross, man. I don't have extra costumes. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go to your. Oh. Yeah. Why, would you say that? <laughs> Why would you say that? Uh so he's dead. Uh, number two is on, not on Huey. I, I, tactically no, subdued. I don't kill. I mean, he just gooped down. That's my one rule. He gooped down. He's being reabsorbed by the tendrils. Except your world. I actually have 47 rules. <laughs> What's rule 43? Uh, that one is never let Cat Noir into the manor. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch steals stuff. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he had that way too ready. All right, number two uh, is going to move for Dan. Because I like how you guys keep leaving Dan. Although, for the record... Wait, leave Dan? I'm 10 no, no. feet away from him. <laughs> but once again, Huey left Dan. I have yeah. 13 AC. I'm going to leave them every time. Yeah, no, that's fair. <laughs> uh, 10, Dan, 10 to attack. Hit. Does, Does not, not hit. <laughs> that's it, Dan. You're up. All right. Ha, ha, ha. And I <laughs> swing at the guy in front of me, and then I do a cool thing, and I stab the guy behind me. So the first attack is on the person in front of me. <laughs> I like the ha, uh, ha, ha. Yeah. Uh, that's my favorite that's part. That's just what I do. Ha, ha, ha. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> for I am the web warrior. So one attack on the first guy, one attack on the second guy. Correct. And okay. 18 to hit. And Andy, can you confirm he can multi-attack? Yes. Okay. I'm just making sure. <laughs> So can no, I, Yeah, I totally can. I can shoot uh, five fire Nine bands. damage on the person balls, in front balls, of me, balls, five on the balls. one behind like me. Yeah. Uh, okay, the one in front of you kind of falls apart on whatever you're swinging. What are you swinging? Uh, my long sword. My web sword. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. I was just picturing, I mean, we played way too much Evil Dead because I was just picturing the bat. <laughs> just just imagine <laughs> that instead of a sheath, I just like 
part of my webbing forms into a sword as I pull it out. It looks cool AF. Now I'm picturing that. Yeah. Right. Like a whip. It does look, yeah. <laughs> it was cool until you made whip noises. Yeah, 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 it, yeah. It's, I mean, it's, it's a web. That, so it's, it's that like, sword Whoa. that like turns into a whip. Well, and I mean, it is it's webs. a whip, yes, it's it's a a whip yes. sword. It's Ivy from Soul Calibur. Yes, yes. Exactly. Without as much booty. So oh. now we got to give Dan stats for a whip sword. Punch the Papa Sorry about that, everybody. I'm Didn't just, mean to punch you. <laughs> ah, <papa! laughs> oh, I knocked you in, guys. <laughs> All right, so that one falls apart. What's the second one? <laughs> Five damage to the one behind me. <laughs> 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 I'm not as proficient on the one no, the on back, the back swing. Yeah, yeah, I'm with it. Uh, oh, yeah, he did kill that one. Okay. No, did he? Yes. What? One's one? there. Yes, you there. killed one. Oh, yeah, I you killed, killed one, and then you went to two, one. Andy. I've yeah. killed and then you two, killed yeah. two. Okay, that's right. All right. That's what I was confused. Like I'm missing. I'm missing a zombie. I'm you guys really, are just secretly taking. Well, them I up the I'm fo- really. <laughs> well, yeah. No, there was one, one that I one killed. This one was right here, dead. Okay. I, I yeah, I helps. killed one already. I just moved it. All right. Uh, that last one's taking a swing at Dan. Uh, not gonna hit with an eight. Nope. You suck. Hugh, you're up. No, he's firebolt. Right. Sorry. Uh, a job, lot sir. to hit. <laughs> a lot to hit. Is it over eight? Uh, very much so. Is it eight fireballs? It's actually just a nine. <laughs> it's very above eight. All right. It's, it's an eight and a half. half. Uh, he <laughs> takes uh, 18 times two <laughs> fire Jesus. damage. 36 I'll damage. do the math. It's fine. He's dead. <laughs> that equals oh death. He goops down and all of the symbiote goo. The t- there was no people inside of those zombies. And it just kind of gets reabsorbed by the tendrils around there. But mine doesn't because it was fire damage. As you look down in the pit, Andy, where you threw the body, you just see symbiote gunk on top of where you did see the butthole key now. Oh, God. I firebolt the gook on top of the key. How many firebolts you got? Is that a cantrip? Uh, it's a cantrip. Oh, okay. I have as many as I need. All of them. <laughs> <laughs> pew, pew. It's a picture. Oh, shit, I'm out of spell slots. <laughs> and it's 2d10 damage. For a cantrip? Yeah. Well, if it misses, it does nothing. That's the downside. Where if a spell I mean, Isn't that how Andy's does... attacks work? Well, yeah, but my spells, if I use a spell slot, they do half damage. Right? Oh, I see. Okay, so yeah. it just acts and like And I only get one okay. attack where they get two. Okay. I was just... Because you're like, if it misses, it does no damage. I'm like... Same thing with Andy's yeah, battle ring. He gets another battle ring to throw. I don't. Spider ring, my bad. Thank you. <laughs> Spider battle ring. Spider battle ring. Uh, all right, so you shoot down the fireball down there. The goo kind of separates to the walls, and you can see the butthole key down there again. I thwip it up. You thwip it up. Yep. Uh, as you shoot it down there, because everything's burning, you manage to thwip it and yank it right out. It's like, woo! I have. And it goes. <laughs> goes. Yeah. It was really in there. <laughs> <laughs> I have the key. Don't touch me. Oh, it's so slimy. <laughs> yeah. Spider Warrior. Nope. Yeah. Nope. This is one that I'm going to just go ahead and say no. <laughs> All right. I, uh, we go back to the door. You're uh, already looking at it. It, so. it just has dark old symbols on it. Thwip, thwip, but you've dubbed thwip, it the butthole thwip, keys. Thwip. thwip. <laughs> I'm thwipping there. <laughs> and Naruto's behind. Naruto, run behind. Gotta bend the arms. Andy too, but you're doing it on the walls, right? Of course. I am the knight. Spider Naruto, Spider Naruto, Spider Naruto, Spider Naruto. Took you guys long enough. You know yeah. we have webs that are pretty quick. Nah. Way faster than running. I've been watching Crunchyroll recently. Uh, <laughs> I insert the anime. butthole key. <laughs> It's, it feels a little <laughs> tight. <laughs> hey, spit on this room. <laughs> and then you can kind of wedge it in there. <laughs> uh, <laughs> just, <laughs> got it. <laughs> you know what? You gotta go gently, gently, gently. You don't want to ram it. As you get into it, the the stretched out carnage face kind of like snaps like broken leather. Oh it just kind of like snaps around and it seems to formulate around the key and get absorbed into it. It's like a nightmare I had once. <laughs> I turn the key. It, it, it's, it all got absorbed it's gone. into it. The, door, the door's gone. Oh. You're just holding a key in midair now. <laughs> Save the key. Just in case. Yeah, you hold on to it. Nope, <laughs> you've been touching it this whole time. I throw it at the web warrior ah! and then flip it onto him. All I, right. Past it, you guys see what appears to be an elevator shaft, but no elevator. No problems. The t- <laughs> yeah, I kind of figured. <laughs> However, will we do this? I'm right behind you. Oh, he just jumps. And I jump onto his web. 
<laughs> have your own webs, goddamn it. Nope. I'm lowering myself upside down that Spider Man thingy does. Okay, cool. I'm going faster, though. <laughs> just, it's I'm fine. Winning. That way you die. If and something I come is back down up. There. That's, a, that's a good point. <laughs> it's like a bungee cord web. <laughs> Snaps Fling. back. Whoa. Oh, no. We're going to go Gwen Stacy on this. No. I cut the the, the bat, bat guys. I forgot his name. His Spider web. Bat. Spider Bat's Literally. Web. Now you're sabotaging each other? <laughs> yeah. Haha, <laughs> you're falling. Oh, no. I teleport through the shadows. <laughs> What will the webbed warrior do? Not my problem. As you enter the second floor, you see a sign. Elevator to the third floor, <laughs> 500 feet that way. And it's like a weird crooked arrow. It looks like old miners must have done it. The hallway looks like a giant carved hallway with three cages on each side. Inside of those cages looks to be scared and dirty miners and villagers, unsure of where to go or what to do. All around the ceiling of the space, you see flying carnage monsters, little bat creatures. <laughs> I start playing Masters of Puppets. <laughs> I do want to state it for the record here. I came up with all these carnage like types right, i so hadn't seen the season sure yet. Yet. <laughs> and then i watched the season right. and i'm like god damn it andy's gonna say that i just watched it oh, he's like i had no idea what stranger things was think uh, about this for a moment so anyway the game is all set in a small town in indiana <laughs> um called falcons hold on hold on. i just want to say i just want to yeah, say sure. we yeah. started doing the spider thing like a month and a half ago so when we prepped yeah, it but not this part no but i had the monsters also, when you guys entered the town sure. pretty sure uh, remember dan got ripped out of a ceiling out. What? I got ripped out of the ceiling? <laughs> Dan doesn't remember what we did yesterday. Why would I think? <laughs> yeah, but you, you, I don't remember getting ripped out of the ceiling. I was always on the ground. No, the, to my the, the first big monster ripped you out of the ceiling. It lifted you into the sky? And then I leaped up and uh, whipped it and held it. That's right. Anyway, they're cool. all flying around the very that's top. Right. Uh, at the center of the room is what appears to be a cube or quivering mass of symbiote goo with a carnage face on it. And standing at the side of the uh, each side it's of it smiling. are two brutes. <laughs> Okay. He's like, guys, <laughs> it's good to see you. We never hang anymore. Ah, get it? Because we're hanging on the ceiling. Oh, Carnegie, you're funny. Our two brutes that are apparently story. leading people in. You Story see three best. people in a line, and as you arrive, you're, you're not able to move fast enough to save one, but one steps into it. As these people go into it, you see like the the face kind of like swallow them whole, and the symbiote stuff cover them, and then they walk out the other side, looking like one of the more impressive thrall kind of creatures. Ooh, it's quite impressive. impressive. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the abs on that one. Damn, talk about a glow up. <laughs> I cast fireball right here. Right in the kisser. <laughs> Were you just counting in your head how just far, see how far away? away it is? I don't have to move. I am far enough away. I cast fireball right you want here. The whole room to be aware of you. All right, uh, it's got no AC. Uh, so these guys will have to make a deck it save. Be hot in there. No uh, you do. Uh, each of those cages have There's human no beings in them. In yeah, they're they're far yeah. enough away. They okay, won't. I'm just. It's only so a twenty foot. 20 feet. So you're just gonna bomb the brutes. Yep. And the two people still standing in front of it. It says there's three in line right there. So there's gonna be two at the stairs. At the stairs? Yeah, they're at the stairs. Because one went through, became the thrall in the back, and there's two standing. I said there's three in line. It's like 10% casually. Like, <laughs> I mean, you might need to just move forward a couple feet and then. No, because then I won't hit them. If I don't hit them, I don't hit them. Yeah, but I wasn't I mean, sure if you wanted to hit the people who are still weak little bitches or the impressive thrall behind. <laughs> I mean, you do have two friends with webbing. That's true. I move in really quick. <laughs> <laughs> I shoot my webs. I like I Andy's like, oh, I see the opportunity. <laughs> I follow Spider-Man and I go, you're my hero. And I copy him. Let's do this, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me now. I'm your sparrow. Uh, we'll have both of you guys roll an attack roll to see if you get the civilians. Come on. Don't be a dick. Don't be a dick roll. Oh. Yours was a dick. What'd you I get? <laughs> and I got a 24. Okay, so you grab your rushing. civilian, Andy, and you begin to pull. Kevin I hits ah. one of the brutes with it. <laughs> hey, you know what? I hit something. <laughs> I try to throw it for the other civilian. All right, give me another one. That's only a 25. Okay, so you get both civilians. You're yanking them out. Dan, I'm, you're I'm gonna gonna shoot, my I want to shoot my second one, and I get a 10. God damn. Give, me a, give me a strength throw for the brute you hit. 
Uh, 11. So 11. You don't make it. So the brute gets the webbing, yanks <laughs> on it, <laughs> pulls you, it'll go 30 feet. Ah, oh, you're fine. Yeah, and you're going to take some fall damage. So you take four damage. Oh, from the fall. I mean, he's got hurt. like 10 health left. Yeah. So. <laughs> and then the fireball hits. Okay. They'll need to make deck saves. <laughs> Uh, where's my marines? We'll use the marines. Didn't marines. have some more down here. They're right there. Oh, want to pull two out for the civilians? Marines. Put them by Andy. 20. 20. Each of the cages has civilians all in them, and you can't see anything else in the room because the cages are in the way. These ones? No, put those two by Andy because those are the ones he just pulled. So we'll say they went 30 feet towards you, Andy. So they're, Hello. So they're about, yeah, they're about where Dan is at this point. Oh. And I cover them with my spider cape. Spider bat cape. Okay, but well then Andy pulled them all the way to him and he covered them. <laughs> so that the explosion doesn't hurt them, even though obviously it wouldn't, but this is just because it looks cool. <laughs> uh, deck saves? Yep. Let me go to my brutes. Uh, gosh. No, known for their them. agility of a negative one. Regardless. Uh, so I got a 17 know. and a 6. So the 17 the makes it. Okay, so the guy on the left. Uh, and this guy too. Exactly. That guy too? Yep. The oppressive thrill? Yep. <laughs> That's what they call me. Uh, he has a 14. Uh, he fails. Okay. So one of them makes it. So the one that makes it, are they, do I double damage on them because it's fire? You will do double damage on these. Uh, all right. So the one that makes it takes 40. The others take 80. <laughs> <laughs> the one on the left, slightly singed. The one on the right, fire kind of burning around him, but he's still alive. Uh, the one in the back, burst into flames. <laughs> Good job. Yeah. Ready. Um, as you now that the room is now exploding, all the people in the cages are like, <gasps> all in shock and awe. The two next to you are like, "Who are you?" They got like rotting teeth though, and like miner's breath, like they haven't brushed their teeth in quite a while. Uh, I'm a Spider Man. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're gonna beat up the monsters. You need to free all of the other miners. <laughs> free the other miners. Yes. Um, We're going to meet up the monsters. You free the miners. Uh, I'm sorry. Did I stutter? <laughs> no, Sometimes people can't understand. You're a little gargling. <laughs> yeah, I, can't, yeah, right. I, can't, I can't quite understand you, you know? Oh, God. Don't do accents. <laughs> well, we're old West no, miners. No, no, no. Stop it. We're gold panning. No, no. I'll stop doing this if you stop doing that. Oh, okay. Sounds good. All right. Stop doing that. Now. <laughs> um, we're going to go fight the monsters. You free the miners. You, what you hear is that the face itself kind of howls. Uh, that can't be good. And as it's howling, you see the walls begin to quiver Even and they begin to move. Pulsate. Even though I hit it with fire yeah, also. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Just checking. No, no, I know. Yeah. It's, Just making sure. The walls all begin to start dropping thralls on the ground on the edges of the map. Ah, the walls are pooping thralls. <laughs> They're thrall pooping walls. I knew it looked like a butthole for some reason. <laughs> I told you we're in the colon of carnage. I'm telling this you, that's true. true. That's, this is how it is. This is just how it is now? This is just how it is now. This is, this is our lives. This is our lives. <laughs> just wandering through a colon. These truly are the days, days of, of our, our lives. lives. <laughs> oh, it smells like poop in here. There's a lot of uh, thralls down here. Oh, my God. <laughs> this. Uh, luckily, it's a pretty big room. We can play just... We can kite them. We'll kite them around. <laughs> I used to play MMOs back in my world. <laughs> They were SMMOs, because spider. <laughs> spider, yeah, yeah, yeah. You see, each wall drops five on the right, three on the left. Two big brutes tumble out of the back of the wall. And as the howling goes through, you hear the echoing of the carnage voice. Well, I found you. Thanks for making me aware. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> that's, it, that's it. You're welcome. <laughs> that's it. You're welcome. And I was just checking the time. Because this is going to be a big fight. How long has it gone in? 55 it's minutes? It's been in like an hour, yeah. An hour? Well, that's convenient. Because then we'll do a cliffhanger! <gasps> How are all our... I almost said bat friends get out of this one. <laughs> <laughs> I think I throw everybody well, off. With we're Spider friends of the bat. <laughs> yeah. How will the friends of the bat get out of this one? Spider bat. <laughs> Spider bat, sorry. Sorry. Uh, uh, where, where should they tune in, Huey? Same Spider bat channel. Same Spider bat place. Time. Time. <laughs> I'm really bad at this. Why am I looking at him instead of you guys? <laughs> Hello, hey, viewers. Why don't you close out the episode? Oh, I can do that. Hey, thanks for tuning in to Dungeons and Ale. What else should I say? <laughs> you just said, oh, I could do that. Promote G Fuel. Use code comics at checkout. 
you could also go sage mode like me and not know how to close out an episode. <laughs> And where can and what should they do to get notifications? Oh, you should subscribe, hit that notification bell, leave a comment down below of how terrible and cringy this outro is. <laughs> it's pretty bad. It's awful. <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys next time right here <laughs> at Dungeons and Ale with the fight of the century.